Well, good morning or good afternoon. Hope you're having a, a good week or a good weekend. Well, I'm doing something else here that's that I've never tried before. I have some Play-Doh, and this will be the first arts type thing that I've done in, since I was in the third grade or sometime in grammar school. I can't remember it was so long ago. By the way, I'd like to consider maybe learning to paint a little bit. I have no talent with that at all. Zero. But I'd just like to see what I might do with it, just for fun. And maybe you'll accompany me on that journey. But I'd like to know from some of you if you have a talent with painting or knowledge of art supplies, which is the best kind of which is the least troublesome kind of painting to learn. And I've done a lot of reading and watched videos about oil painting and acrylic and watercolor and even just painting with the little, little teeny brushes. I'm kind of thinking I might start with that. The, uh, the brushes with, uh, there's two ends on them. One is like a, a brush and it's like a little a kind of a tip for fine for fine uh, writing or, or printing. So which one is the is the best for a beginner like me and someone with almost with no artistic ability, which requires the least effort to learn, the least cleanup, and I guess which dries the fastest. Like I said, I've watched a lot of videos and I've talked to some to two or three art instructors. I've been to Michael's three or four times and to uh, Hobby Lobby. And I, like everything else, I always research everything. But I'd like to know from you, from you out there, what kind of, of uh, painting do you think would be the best for me to do? Remember, easy, for, best for a beginner. Uh, no artistic ability, and it, I guess it that uh, it cleans up pretty easily. I know oil painting has it, all of them have a pluses and minuses, but you can tell me in the comments what you think about that. And right now, I'm going to make something with this play doh. opened a couple of them up already to sort of see how it how it felt after all these years. And I remember the way it smelled too. See, I got into this one already and messed around with it a little bit. These two I'd already messed with. These three I just took them out of the container. Should have had my glasses. I I can't read the the colors very well. Contains wheat. Is that? I guess maybe. Children have to worry about that. If they're real young, they put all kind of stuff in their mouths. You know how that is, or swallow stuff, you know. So 
got kind of a sort of a whitish background right here. I wouldn't, didn't, didn't know exactly how to set up the camera either. I wasn't sure how that was going to be. What's about the simplest thing I can make? Maybe like a sun? <laughs> yeah, it still smells the same as I remember from so long ago. It still feels the same. Yeah. I have a feeling this will be the only one of these kind of videos that I'll be making. Maybe it's not even going to be a sun. I don't know. Actually, I thought that it would be a lot bigger. Can I make this bigger? Trying to make it as big as I can and kind of kind of round too. It's like a pancake. Mama, what are you humming? She's, it might be some old song from the um, 30s or 40s or maybe even the 20s. Sometimes she would just say, oh, I don't know. Just something I made it. Well, hmm. it's kind of the same color as this uh, background here. But I guess it Looking at the camera, I guess it shows up okay. And now, what else? What will I add to it? Maybe kind of a, the sun's going to be radiating, right? Let's see how that goes. Uh oh. Hmm. If I continue to do this, which I doubt. I need to have these things tied down somehow or stapled down. Hadn't thought about that. But then again, this is as far as I've gotten doing this. As I told you before, I have no artistic talent. I'm not afraid to try different things either. Not like I'm in school and going to get evaluated. Not like I'm at work. And somebody might not like something I've done. Although that was very rare in the last 10 or 20 years. I pretty much got away with whatever I wanted to. People trusted my work to be to be sound. I wish I could read these colors. Darn. Why didn't I check that before? I can't read it. But you can. Where is it? At the bottom there. This is a... You can read that color and tell me... You can tell me in the comments what it is. That one. Mm 
sun sign. I can almost see it in the, in the camera better than I can looking at it in person, or if you want to call it. Maybe you won't be able to see it either, I don't know. So here are the here are the rays of the sun, right? I didn't get these mixed up, did I? No, I guess so. Blue, we're going to give it kind of a I think that's going to be the it's going to be a happy sun. I'm not going to have any unhappy things here. There's enough unhappiness in the world. And with current things that are going on yeah, I don't, want to, I don't want to think about all of that. I guess I'll turn it this way. Maybe she can. So it's uh, sort of facing. The camera can see it better. Can see the design better. It's going to have a happy face. Here we are. What else? What else do we need? Oh, maybe some eyes. Oops. Turn this around like that. It's going to be like this. There, that's the eye. And there's an eye there. The eyes have it. Hmm. This can get confusing to this with this. Give it kind of a nose. I have no idea how a nose is going to look. <laughs> hey, how about a uh, about some eyelashes? Yo, baby, what up with the eyelashes, man? This little play doh cost me about two dollars. It's so cheap. Well, it doesn't look much like the sun. That's the way it started out to be. The rays. The mouth, the nose, eyes, eyelashes. It didn't have any yellow. I thought with the color of the... I thought one of these would be kind of yellow, but it's not, so... Anyway. This will probably be the only time you'll see this Play-Doh. I think it looks more like a pancake. It started out to be the sun. I don't know what it looks like. But anyhow. That's going to be it for today. 
Let me know your thoughts about painting. And I wish you the best and check you later.